We're learning the cause of a lot of the sewage overflows we've been having lately. Of course, the heavy rains are the main contributors. But there's something else, baby wipes. Utility companies say those wipes are clogging up sewage pipes. NBC 15's Justin Moore joins us now. Justin, the utilities say these wipes are anything but flushable. Yeah, they may go down when you flush, but once they leave your toilet bowl, they could create a major problem. Please do not flush these wipes because they are harmful for our system. A plea tonight from Samantha Campos would deafening utilities to not toss flushable wipes down the toilet. They may flush down when you uh, turn the knob on your toilet, but they are not breaking down in our system. It's creating a big mess like this. Sewage pumps clogged with clumps of wipes, resulting in sewage overflows which spill into rivers and creeks. Daphne Utilities has seen more wipes flow through its system since the pandemic started. Luckily for them, just before the pandemic, these baskets were installed inside lift stations to catch wipes. It's something crews check daily. They do have to come out so often to empty the baskets and make sure they're not overflowing. Flushable wipes are a problem across the board for all sewage companies. The wipes are not breaking down in the system like toilet paper. Instead, the wipes bond with other materials like grease, which lead to sewage overflows. Utility companies are advising people to use toilet paper or toss the wipes in a trash can. Do you know why companies sell it as flushable wipes? I do not. I wish that we did. I know that utilities across um, the U.S. are having the same problem, and we're trying to combat that. Now, Daphne Utilities is really trying to uh, get this problem under control. In fact, uh, they're going into neighborhoods that use a lot of wipes and leaving door tags, uh, letting people know uh, how to safely dispose those wipes. Live tonight, Justin Moore, NBC 15 News.